All right, everybody. We had 10 tumultuous games, but we finally did it. After a lot of hard fighting, we are the sole undefeated team in the little league. <laughs> Eat it, Mets. We are the champions now. Also, I will also point out that uh, I actually have a guest here tonight. I am not alone. Uh, you want to say hi? No, he doesn't. Well, I'm joined by the one, the only, the greatest emperor of all time, Caesar. And by that, I mean my parents' cat. Because <laughs> I am cat-sitting uh, for them while they are away. He probably won't be very vocal, but he might. He's just kind of hanging around. But if we're lucky, we'll get a meow or two out of him. And if we're really unlucky, he'll be walking across my keyboard. <laughs> so, <laughs> I don't know. But he's here regardless, or he might get scared away based on me being loud during the stream. I don't know. He's a very unpredictable cat, <laughs> as cats are wont to be. Anyhow, looks like today we're facing off against the Hornets. Fish versus Hornets. Do fish eat hornets? I don't know. Fish eat bugs. I bet, I bet if you put like a dried hornet on a, like, a fishing line, uh, some fish would eat it. So, that's already off to a good start. And it's... No, it's an away game. That is not what the home games look like, Artie. Alright. Let's go and see what the stat fluctuation is like. Hopefully... Oh, yes! It's Ekman Acres! One of the best courses. This is going to be fantastic. Alright. Let's see our lineup. Tony. Alright. Tony's fine. Lisa's fine. Morgan's fine. Mikey's fine. Dante's fine. Oh, no. Pete. Oh, Pete got hit with the decreases bad. He, <laughs> He's having those post-birthday blues. I feel you, Pete. It, it, when you're young, it can be it can be depressing right after your birthday. Oh, the cat's walking away. Whoops. Arthur's fine, Marky's fine, and Pablo's fine. Okay, so we're going to move Pete down in the batting lineup, I think. Because, yeah, he's also not that fast today. He's still decent speed, but let's try Dante first. Let's move Arthur up in the lineup, too. Pete doesn't have to be, like, all the way at the bot. Like, he's still a decent... He'll still be decent at offense. He'll still be all, all reasonably fast. Let's... Let's put him... Actually, yeah. I think that should be fine. Let's try that. I'll still keep him in the center field. He should have... He should have a reasonable time of it. All right. Let's look at the Hornets. They have Billy Mendelson. Oh, he sucks. They have Chrissy Mulligan. She's all right. Not at offense, though. Nikki Winston. He's decent at batting. Uh, Hannah Peavy. She's good at batting. Carlos Ocampo. He's he's decently fast. Aaron Harris. She sucks. Melvin Berger. He sucks. Oh, no. We got Keisha Phillips. Okay, I'm a little worried. Ke Keisha's really like, Coach, you really should have kept me after Season 1. But I guess not. And Katie Shanker. Okay, so they have some really bad characters on their team. The only ones I have to look out for are Keisha... Nikki and Hannah. Those are really the only three. All right, this this team sucks. They, like compared to the Mets, this team is garbage. This should be easy. Welcome back to Baseball Fever, all you crazy fans. Hi there, sports fans. I'm Sunny Day, along with my partner Vinny the Gooch. Say hello to the nice people, Vinny. Nice. I got a bowl of potato salad dumped on my head on the way in here. Oh, Vinny, behave. What? It's true. <laughs> not like the queen, the green fishes, and the white hornet. Whatever these kids are doing, it's working for them. This has been a great season so far. Each one of the players is thinking about the playoffs, and they have a good chance of making it if they keep it up. And now it's time for the action to begin. Let's show the fishes what their fans are made of. Woo! I love how we're the green fishes and we're purple and they're the white hornets and they're purple as well. I guess they have some white accents as well, though. All right, Ekman Acres, this should be a fun stage. Let's play ball! All right, Dante. And the fun is just beginning. Quite literally. Eat your hot dog, get your energy. Okay, let's go. All right. I'm going to try hitting it away from first base, so not hitting it open. I realize that if I hit it open, it's much more likely to go to first, so let's try to minimize that. 
What is he waiting for? Hmm, I don't know about that one. All right. Dante, you're pretty fast. You can get to first, right? <laughs> Dante, you can make contact with the ball, right? <laughs> My uh, land, some characters just foul it too much. I have a feeling that Keisha Phillips is going to be carrying their team. She's the only character on their team that's actually, like, really good. I might get proven wrong, but that's what it looks like to me. Ooh, nice one, Odante. Never mind. That was a really bad one. Don't worry, we've got a real MVP up at bat now. Alright, Arfur. You're fast. You're here to last. That's too high. That was much too high. Arfur is skilled at batting, and he's pretty fast, so he should be able to get a single if we just do a line drive. And if he doesn't, well, our MVP Mikey can <laughs> certainly help us out. Come on, Arfur. Okay, decent energy, let's just focus on hitting it straight next time. I thought I got the timing right on that one. That's going to go too far. Ah, uh, there's Keisha with her old <laughs> Hollywood banter. <laughs> Is that Arthur's big hit? Darn it, it's not quite Arthur's big hit. Run, 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 run. And nice double, Arfur. It was it was almost the big hit, but not quite. Oh, that was beautiful, Arfur. That's exactly what I'm looking for in my play. <laughs> what am I saying? Why am I nervous when the only person here is the cat? I feel like I'm actually performing for like a new audience. That's a strike. No, it's not. Maybe it's just be streaming in a different location than I usually do. Walking Mikey would probably be a good idea. It's what I would do. <laughs> Actually, maybe it's not what I would do. Are you having cake? <laughs> now that is a big hit, but she's going to catch it because it's a pop fly. That's okay. We can advance Arfur. Right, Arfur? <laughs> that was close. Good job. Good hustle, Arfur. All right, Pablo, we just need to get Arthur home. If you walk Pablo, you get the real danger up next. And by that, I mean Du Bois. All right. Ooh, that was a beautiful hit, Pablo. Oh, that was really good. Go to second. Oh, man, they suck. I almost could go to third, but not quite. Actually, okay, their left fielder has no arm. <laughs> <laughs> I have to remember that. Nash one, Marky! Even though you haven't done anything, I just know it's going to be a Nash one. Alright, let's try to hit it to the left. Keep hitting it to their left fielder. Exploit the weakness. The problem is we can't... Because we have two outs, we can't use Pablo as a diversionary tactic. They're just going to try to get Marky out. Their pitcher is not very good. Either that or she's purposefully throwing a lot of balls. Granted, it, it didn't look like they had a lot of good pitchers to begin with, so they might this she might be the best they have. I didn't notice any pitcher higher than a six. Okay, I'll take the walk. Yuck! <laughs> They're afraid of Marky. They didn't walk Mikey or Pablo, but they walked Marky. That tells you everything you need to know. Oh yeah! Master Tony. <laughs> Master Darn It Tony. So, fun fact, I actually I actually did some batting practice in this game be right before stream started, just to kind of get a feel for batting. I used Pete Wheeler and I used Tony. I hit power with Tony like 10 times and none of them made it to the outfield. That's how bad he is at hitting power. So, it's just going to be line drives forever from now on, for always and eternity. Yeah. Tony was a disappointment in batting practice. Pete dominated, though. He was great. What are they doing? Are they trying to get bases loaded for, I believe, Pete Wheeler next? Pete Wheeler is not great, but he could probably advance. 
Get Chrissy off the mound. She ain't doing nothing. Okay. We know how to walk. I believe it's Pete Wheeler next. That or Stephanie Morgan. I can't remember. Rats. Okay, that's actually kind of bad. But Pablo is the one on third, so if we can hit it to left field, I think Pablo can advance home. Yeah, we might only need to play one inning in order to get an idea of who's going to win. I... What are they doing? Is Chrissy just blind or half blind? Okay. Pop fly, but maybe they'll be stupid. No, they won't. Wow, it bounced off of that kid, and then Keisha's just like, oh, I got this! <laughs> and she definitely did. All right. Well, we almost made it through our batting lineup first season. All right, Carlos. Yeah, Keisha literally is their team, their entire team. She's kind of their one redeeming quality. But hey, Keisha Phillips can be a one-woman army, so I am still a little nervous of that. Oh. He's barely swung at all, Marky. Just calm yourself. Yeah, we did. Let's throw Carlos the heat to give him a good opportunity. Nope, he's, he stinks. <laughs> Bye, Carlos. Oh, don't be mad. You'll get another chance. Probably only one more, but you never know. Billy Mendelssohn. Now, Billy Mendelssohn was a really clumsy kid. On the first day of first grade, I'll tell you what he did. He thought he could hit it to Lisa Crockett. She threw it to Mark Dubois and got him out. All right. Here's where... Honestly, Keisha could tie it up right now. It's entirely possible. But, nope. Nice one, Stephanie. That's my shortstop. It might be a short game today, folks. Why is the next at bat blinding? Is it just because their team is the color white? I don't know. All right, Pete. I'm gonna hit a touchdown. Let's do line drive with Pete. Try to get it to the outfield. Hopefully, he'll be fast enough to get to first. I want to hit it closed, if at all possible. Closed is most likely to hit it to their really bad left fielder. Okay, that works too. Ooh, yeah! In between them. Nice single, Pete! Still Mr. Consistent. Good job. I am astonished they don't have Keisha in their outfield, because Keisha's like made for the outfield. She's fast, can catch stuff, is tall, and has a good arm. Like, if you're not putting Keisha in the outfield, then what are you doing with your life? Okay. I just want one of them to advance. Okay, that's fine. Um, I was hoping that would go out of play, but it didn't. Alright. At least no double play. You tried, Pete. But Lisa's not going to be able to hit it out of, the out, out of the infield. Oh, boy. Well, the good news is they probably won't get both of them out. Because Dante is fast. Usually not fast enough all by himself, but if there's somebody else to distract, then maybe he will be. They literally hit his shoe. Boo! Get Chrissy out of here! Too high. Oh, I guess that was a strike. I have a feeling that the innings where we're pitching are going to be really short, but then the inning halves where they're pitching are going to be take a while, because... They, they're basically throwing free balls every single time. I think Chrissy left her contact lenses at home. Chrissy, I can keep this up as long as you can. Actually, longer, because you're the one who's running out of juice. Okay. Interesting choice. Arthur, if you want a big hit now, this could be opportune. Nicely done. I'm still going to hit line drive with Arthur, though. We need distance. Ideally, line drive to the left field. That's that's the ideal. Alright! 
That's going to drop. Bases loaded for Mikey Thomas. This is promising. Nice one, Arthur. Acho! Oh boy! Time for power. You're gonna do better than that, Mikey. You're gonna get like a, your third Grand Slam of the season, unless they walk you. If you walk us, you're welcome to, but we're gonna get a point out of that. <laughs> but we might get four points if you don't. What are they doing? Get this girl off the pitcher's mound! Even, even Keisha Phillips would be better than this! At least Keisha can throw the heat really well. No, Mikey! Why would you... What, Arthur? What, Arthur? I did... Arthur literally moved forward of his own volition. I did not tell him to. Why did they try to get Dante out and not Mikey? If they had thrown to first, they would have gotten a double play. Okay, well, I'm still excited. Pablo could get a Grand Slam. They should be very scared. They should be very scared. They should be extremely scared of the secret weapon. Oh! And they've scratched out another run. Good hustle. These kids are on their way. She's going to play it off the wall. I'm de no, I won't go home with Mikey. That's the kind of hustling Darn it. That's the second home run that just barely didn't happen. Rats. Still, we got two points out of that. Oh, yeah. Dried apricots. Let's go power of Marky. That cursed bush, yeah. That's Ekman Acres. Everyone, you may as well try to advance. Wow! Nice job, Marky! <laughs> That's real good, boy! Dane, Marky, Mr. Consistent. I love him. Marky is low-key one of my favorite characters on my team. Maybe in my top three favorites. Love how you heard that crack, and yet Tony's still out. <laughs> still, that was a great inning. Three points, I love that. That's okay, we haven't gotten to pass the bush yet. They probably won't either. And you know, even if they do, we're still three points up. <laughs> Denied. You don't get anything past Mad Dog. Oh, hey, speaking of which, it's the other one we have to worry about. All right, Lisa. Nice one, Arford. Nice catch, Marky! Get her out! All right, Aaron. Piece of cake. Here, right over the plate. And it's a hook. Oh! Oh! That was nice. I gotta, I gotta give that one to her. She was, that was impressive. Not quite at the ground rule double though. Excuse me, the ball is behind you. All right, she got a double. So no shutout game. That's, that's okay. That was a good hit for from her. That was really good. Actually, was, was Aaron another one who was good at batting that I forgot about? No, wow, she just got unbelievably freaking stinking lucky with that hit. Okay. Wow. That was like, that was the computer equivalent of Marky Dubois hitting a natural home run on Playground Commons. That's fine, they're entitled to have some lucky moments as well. Alright, smoke her out. Don't smoke, kids. No, you're hitting it into rabbits. Oh, thank you. It didn't hit into rabbits garden. Also, why is there a lawnmower on the field? Can't we get Kimmy's parents to get that out of there? Fatal mistake. Get out. All right, Stephanie, Pete, Lisa. Not, not the best. 
But not... Actually, no, they are the worst. Never mind. I was about to... But they're not the worst on my team. No, they are, actually. At least in terms of offense, and at least today. Chrissy has pitched 56 pitches in a row. Most of them have been balls blatantly outside the strike zone, but they still refuse to take her off the mound. Is there some weird, like, AI coding for Chrissy that is causing her to throw balls much more frequently? I'll take the walk. You're not getting her and Pete Wheeler out. I don't think that's gonna happen. Alright, Pete, you hit a single last... Uh, uh, yeah, it was last inning. Well, you're gonna hit a line drive, actually. Same thing, I guess. Nice hustle. Good job. But I can't tell if they're trying to get a double play or if they're just being very stupid. There we go! Finally they got her off the mound. Alright. Keisha is a much better choice for pitcher. Still not great, but can I expect a lot more heats to be thrown? <laughs> You're off to a great start, Keisha. Still, I think Keisha's going to be less threatening on the pitcher's mound than on first base when it comes to defense. Thank, thank you, Keisha. That was a good hit, Lisa. They're going to catch it, though. No, they're not. Whoo! Nice hustle! Oh, no, but you know who's next. Hmm. Strategic move. I'm not going to swing. If they strike him out, they strike him out, and then Arthur can hit it into the outfield. But I think with Dante, we're not going to advance, and we might get a double play. Alright, that's fine, Dante. Yeah, next time, Dante. You'll do much better. But we got my lucky charm. He is two for two today. Go ahead, pitch heat to the outside, Keisha. Darn, she did, and I I flubbed it. Alright! That's not infield. That was past the infield. That's fine, no double play then. And Mikey Thomas can get a grand slam. Mikey, you you've been... You've been off your game today, but that's okay. Third time's the charm. Uh, darn it, Mikey. Everybody run. Nope. Nope, we're out. No, we're not! Why did they throw it to first? There was nobody there! I'm so confused why they just did that. There was nobody at first base. Pablo Sanchez steps in. I wouldn't want to meet this kid okay, I'll take it. I scored two points. That's fantastic. What I'm learning, what I'm learning about this game, this game is very real, in that it is little league. They assuming they assuming we had a kid as the umpire, and the umpire makes real life mistakes. Umpire's human. Darn. If that wasn't a foul, that would have been absolutely out of the park. Old friends now. New enemies. Oh. That's not... That's barely in a pop fly. Keisha's got that. That's okay. Two points. Katie, let's see if you can hit this. Cool. How fast is she? She's slow. Let's try for a double play. Tony's got a good arm. So he can throw it to second. Oh. Oh, this is... Oh, rats. If that had moved a little slower, that would have been a perfect double play, but alas. Oh, hey, Carlos gets another chance. Carlos, did you come here on the Magic School Bus? Hmm. If he wants to bunt, I say let's let him. Here, slow ball. Perfect bunting opportunity. Provided Lisa throws it in the strike zone. Okay, Lisa's incapable of throwing the slow ball. Let's throw a left hook again. Let's throw the right hook. Cool. No! That hadn't moved past the stripes yet. 
Dante, I'm not afraid to turn off chatter again. Rats, no double play for Artie. There he goes. Ooh, no match for the Thomas, though. Micah Thomas has got it on pat. <laughs> and then he did a little dance. All right, Marky Tony Stephanie. Things are going swimmingly for the fishes. Now, Marky usually does his best when there's somebody on base, but this is okay. But that's because he's so slow, he doesn't have much stamina to lose. All right, Marky, I got faith in you, boy. Let's hit this one in the outfield. Maybe they should have recorded more than two voice clips for that. Okay, that, I wanted you to hit it a little bit harder than that, Marky. Oh, but she's super slow. That's her old pitcher. You got this, Marky. You got this, Marky. Oh my gosh, Marky. She's super slow. Go to second. This is going to be Marky to boy double. Yeah! Ha! Marky's like, you think I can't get on first? I'm going to get a double. Marky is low key like my most consistent player. It's insane. Rats. Okay, is it my imagination or is Tony's strength lowering every game? Like he's struggling it to hit it out of the infield right now. This this is not supposed to be the Tony Del Vecchio way. No, not rabbit's carrot <laughs> garden. <laughs> Rabbit suffered enough. The only time Tony got on base today was because they walked him. Oh, big mistake. Big mistake. Wow, Tony, you are very slow. But that's a hit. <laughs> All right, Steph. Do, 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 do. Oh, I, guys, you know what I just realized? I think we can actually steal with Tony. I think we can steal with Tony, actually, because Marky's on third. They don't want to throw at the second lest he steal home. Not a... F oh, just barely. I'm going to see if that will work. Because worst case, we can turn around and we'll get back. Ooh! Nice one, Steph. Let's go home. Yeah, you can get Tony out. That's okay. Yeah, nice job, Marky! <laughs> Marky ran home without needing a home run. Boom! That's what I wanted. Although this does set up the opportunity for the double play, because we got two pretty fast people, I don't think that'll happen. And if it does, well, you know what? That just makes the game a bit more interesting. I'm here for the content and to be undefeated. So I do actually want to win. But I, I, I am seven points up. I can feel a bit cocky. Okay, well, is that an infield fly? Yep. Oh, doggone it. This means Robinson's back up. Why do I have Ro Dante and Lisa back to back? This is a bad idea. Alright, Dante. Dante, let's head it to left field and get everyone advanced. Too high. Not too high, apparently. Alright, I think... Did they buff Keisha's pitching in this game? Because I remember only her heat being good. But she just pitched a slow ball with an incredibly small shadow. Darn it! <sighs> All right, Keisha. Oh no, they're free all stars. The free characters that actually could turn the game around. You bunted with Keisha Phillips. That is a really, really stupid idea, especially because she's tired from pitching. Why would you do that? Did they just not realize how slow she was from being tired, or did they actually think Keisha would be fast enough? Yeah, it would really shake things up, but I don't want them to get a special bat. They could get five crazy bunts like I did that last game. Nice, Lisa. Good job. Wow, that was only the third strikeout of the game, though. I've always liked the name Hannah. Oh, and it switched to Heat. 
It's one of those good Bible names. Also, I don't. I think in all, in all my life, I haven't met like a. I don't. I hate to say a bad Hannah, but you know how you meet some people where you're just like, oh, you have ruined that your name for me forever. Haven't had that with any Hannahs yet. All right, Arthur. As opposed to what? Dante doesn't want to hit every time. <laughs> Not a big hit. Don't don't catch it. Drop it. No. If Arthur had gotten a big hit off an elevator, that would have been like legendary. But alas, doesn't happen. Okay, Mikey, we got this, buddy. Okay, Mikey, you gotta give it some height today. You've been hitting grounders nonstop. With power, we want it out of the stadium. There we go. It's still gonna be a pop fly, and they're gonna catch it because they don't ever drop pop flies. That's what I've noticed. The computer player pretty much never drops pop flies, at least when they go to the outfield. Keisha just has nothing but hatred for our team now for dropping her. Because she honestly was a pretty good player for a season. Oh, Billy's up next. Billy's on the mound. Their center fielder was on the fence? Oh, I didn't see that. Oh, no, they put Keisha on home. Oh, shoot, they're going to catch that. Yep. Three pop flies. They caught them all. Bring me some pancake batter, batter. Boom. You, no getting it past the wall. You, you just can't. Oh, that's what happened. Inter I thought you were saying like the, the center fielder was standing on top of the fence. How slow? Oh, my gosh. Let her go to first. Let, let her go to first. <laughs> Lisa is like brutally shoves past Tony all the time when he's like, no, 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 let's get a double play. Now we just have to hope Katie is skilled enough at baseball to actually make a contact hit that's not a foul. She is. Excellent. Ah! Get him out! <laughs> Throw to home, shove. I mean, Lisa is probably maxed out at aggression. All right, we have one inning to use whatever special bat we just got. Screaming line drive, nice. I like screaming line drive. Nice one, Marky. Oh no, right to the first dash, not nice. Oh, rat! That always. Ha How does their first baseman just know where to be? All right, Tony. I don't want to use my screening line drive until I have someone on base. Darn it, Tony! Tony, you gotta beat them to first base. Oh my gosh. They did the stupid thing again. <laughs> their first baseman sucks. They should have kept Keisha on first. Oh hey! Perfect time for screaming line drive. Actually, no. No, we're not using the screaming line drive. Pete can use it better. And we can get Stephanie to first without needing it. Unless she pop flies it to somebody. There we go. Now here's how we get him. Thanks, Tony. You were a great diversion. Boom, boom. Now it's time for the screaming line drive. We actually could potentially get a home run with this if Pete hits it just right. No, don't foul it. Right into Rabbit's cabbage patch again. Poor Rabbit. Did we just use our only screaming line drive? Gosh darn it, Carrie. Well, that usually happens. Oh, Tony got out. What a shocker. 
Uh oh, it's all on you, Mad Dog. <laughs> That's that's far from the first screaming line drive I fouled. I think Lisa has personally fouled two of them. But you know what? That's okay. Okay, past the first. Ooh, that was beautiful, Lisa. That was really good. Let's have everyone advance, except Lisa. Nice job, Lisa. That was great. Oh no, who's next? Why? Yeah! Thank you for stating the obvious, Vinny. Look at this kid. Four at batting. Four at batting my butt. He's a one. Gotta watch your kneecaps on those taters. Yeah, and he advanced, people. All right, you know what? That's the way to get things done. You know what, Dante? I take it back. You're not a one at batting. You're a two. Okay, Arthur. Let's get a big hit and bring us home. 50%. Arthur's big hit. Come on. That's not a strike. Okay. Pass the second baseman. Oh, yes. Arthur, that was great. Oh my gosh, Dante's going home as well. Oh my gosh, Arthur might go home. Arthur! That wasn't the big hit, but my gosh, that was a good hit. Okay, Arthur's not going home. Triple for Arthur! Wow, that was amazing. That was so good! Arthur, my man! All right, all right, Mikey. Please don't hit it as a grounder. Please. Oh! Now that's what I'm talking about. That's a foul, isn't it? No, it's not. Ground rule double for Mikey Thomas. We score another point. Oh my gosh, guys! I don't think they're gonna win. Okay. Nice pop up. They're not going to catch it, though. Oh, shoot, Mikey. I need you to run. They're like, they're so terrified of Mikey. Oh, wait, no, that's Keisha Phillips. Red Sox just hit a Grand Slam. Nice going, Red Sox. Oh, yeah! You know, when... When we started... This in when we started this inning by following the screaming line drive, I was kind of worried that we wouldn't score anything. Great, great for Okisha. All right, Marky. Oh my gosh, how many? This is their fourth pitcher now. Oh, that was that was stupid of me. That was way too early. That's okay, Mark. It's just nerves. Oh, that's okay, Marky. Women, women broke double digits this, this inning. No, that was entirely fair. That was just me being a dummy. All right, five points that inning. That was great. All right, Melvin, Carlos, and Billy. <laughs> He's, they all have the exact same face. I can't. But yet, they're all different races. <laughs> Funny how that happens sometimes. All right. 23 hit game. That was an impressive bunt there, Melvin. I wish that it wasn't a foul. <laughs> it was almost a perfect game as well, if it weren't for... Me trying to get them get some double plays. You know what? Let's make it interesting. Okay, they couldn't hit it. <laughs> I normally never throw the crazy balls, but you know what? We're 12 points up. 
Okay, Carlos, this is your third time. You've been struck out twice. Oh my gosh, a fireball. Oh wow, the crazy ball did not tire Lisa out at all. That barely made her lose any juice. Why did you keep doing it? Let's see if they can actually hit the crazy ball. Oh, you said crazy pitch? Like this? Oh. Let's try it again. We can't do it again. Can we fireball? Hadouken! I love, I love how accurate Lisa's fireballs are. Dante, I'm this close to turning off the chatter for the last at bat because of you. Wow, we still have more fireballs. Oh my gosh, stop talking about underpants. It's not funny. Wink! All right, sorry, Billy, but this is where you say goodbye, because Mikey Thomas got a concussion, but it don't even matter, because Mad Dog... Oh. What are you doing? Why are you doing that? Why did you do that? That was colossally stupid of you. All right! <laughs> he just wants to end it. <laughs> Tonight at the victory party, it's rumored that Ahmed and some of his cousins are going to bring out their instruments and rock out. Despite that, the party should be a lot of fun. Yeah! Boys, this is Sunny Day, wishing you all peace, harmony, and great baseball. See you next time! Wow, that was quite a game. <laughs> 12 points, that is nothing to sneeze at right there. 12 to nothing, that... Wow, they sucked. They had a lot of really bad players on their team, but even Keisha didn't really do much. That game was also far too long considering the outcome. Like, most of that game was just us waiting for them to actually pitch strikes. 12 to nothing. That's that's great. Nice job, Arthur. You did you did real good, buddy. Alright, next time on Wednesday, we'll be facing off oh, against the Tampa Bay Devil Rays and a home game at that. Oh that'll, that'll be fun. So now we're we're still undefeated. We've clinched the playoffs. We're eleven to nothing. Uh Padres have seven, Giants, Cardinals, and Expos have six, Melonheads and Twins have seven, Bombers have eight, the Indians have ten, the Mariners have eight. Oh, see? Now that the Mets lost once, now they're going to lose a bunch. That's that's how it's going. That's gonna how it's gonna go. <laughs> Alright, going to the league leaders now. Pete and Mikey with the most hits. Makes sense. And Pablo and Dot Dante with most hits? Are you kidding me? Have you seen that kid's patty batting average? He sucks. Pablo and Mikey with the most runs batted in. Pete and Dante on runs scored. Yep. Pete, Mikey, and Lisa on batting average. That's really surprising to me. Pete and Pablo with the most steals. Lisa Crockett still has by far the most strikeouts. Uh, Lisa Crockett with a high run average. This is great. I love this. I love this so much. Kind of sad that 18 hits at this stage is one of the season puts him within the league leaders. <laughs> yeah, yeah. There haven't been a whole lot of there haven't been a whole lot of good hitters, I guess. Well, that was great. Hey there, my name is Lucky. Your name is Arthur, actually, and you you really did us proud out there, Arthur. Actually, you everybody did us proud today. Well, Tony less so. The kids around here call me Vec. I think it's short for Del Vecchio. That's my name, Del Vecchio. I mean. You think it's short? You don't know? Okay, great, Tony. I'm, I'm, I'm glad. <laughs> Tony wasn't that great today, but even Pete with his decreases, he did pretty well. Like everyone pulled their own weight today. I'm, I'm really happy with you guys. Very proud of you all.